Aloha Cousins, Briar626 here, and today I have something very special for you guys, and it is a box opening of the Battle Brawlers set from the Bakugan line here. We are opening up all 24. Well, in this video, we're only going to open up 12, but in the next one, we're going to do the rest of the 12, so we're going to split this into two parts, uh, box opening here, but we got a whole box here. Um, I got it at my uh, target here. Um, it wasn't a close target, but it was a target uh, in general. It um, wasn't too terribly far, but they said they had them. I went over there, and I picked them up, and I got them. So, yeah, so here is a whole box, like I said. Um, so, yeah. So, let's go on ahead and get into the unboxing or unpacking. How are you getting into this? Let's go on ahead and get into this here. Alrighty, so we have our whole box here of all 24 packs. I counted there's 24, and that is the whole box there. Um, and like I said, I went to Target uh, to get this here. Um, I had to ask for it, and they had it in the back, so they brought it up here because they weren't supposed to be released yet. So I got them from them early, so which is cool. Um, but yeah, so we're going to open up 12, so we're going to get the first 12 here. So... Here is our 12 there that we have. Um, these we're going to sit to the side here, and we'll open that up in another video. Um, so, yeah, so we have the first 12 here. So, they are, of course, come in the uh, packs here. Uh, let's go ahead and see. We spread them out here. Um, so, there they are there. Um, you can see the back side here. You can see, of course, this is like that little plastic uh, or paper, cardboard type packaging with the packs inside. Of course, that does have the app on the top, so go ahead and check that app. Um, I am going to be doing a video on this um, shortly after uh, the this pack opening that you see. It'll probably be the next video after the second pack opening. We probably because of this. Um, and of course, if you do want to see me the, of getting these uh, cards um, at the Target, there's a video, a card right there to show you guys of that uh, video. It, it might be a short one. Um, I haven't really put it together yet, but... I'm just so excited for these. I had to get these opening before I edited the other video, so I had to get them open. So yeah, so here's what the backside is um, and everything like that. So yeah, so I'm gonna go on ahead and unbox uh, or unpack all of these here and just leave the cards sitting to the side here um, because this is some time to get unboxing. So yeah, so we're gonna go on ahead and get those all unboxed. But first, let me show you the different pack arts here because they have, I think, three different pack arts. So yeah, so we have the um, Nilius, the darkest Nilius. The uh, Drago, um, the Pyrus Dragonoid, and we get, I think, yeah, here it is. So we get the Aquas um, Hy um, Hydorus. So this is like the three packs that we get, uh, pack art. I think it's the same thing for the actual pack art that you get in uh, in this here. So yeah, so let's go ahead. I'm going to get these all unpacked here and send them down there, and we'll get you guys here just in a second. Alrighty, so we have all 12 packs there, um, and of course what's really cool is that the packaging that they come in, um, this type of packaging here, whatever the art is on the front is actually what the pack art is, which is actually really cool. Um, usually they don't do that, because like Pokemon, they don't have that, they just put whatever it's the front and whatever color pack it is in there. Um, so yeah, so of course here's the back side, advertising the app and stuff like that. They do all have a notch up top. Um, to help tear it open. So we're going to set those to the side here. Um, actually, we'll just set them right there so you guys can see them there. Um, and I'm just going to go ahead and open them here. Um, there's no pack trick to this. Um, it is literally just the first six are common. The next one is, there's next two are rare. And then you have your other two, which could be an awesome rare, a um, super rare, a, oh, what is it? Um, a Bahugan Elite. Uh, which is like the rarest one and then the last card is a, a hex card so yeah so here we are in our first pack we have a uh, terrify um, which is really cool darkest terrify um thought decay that's another darkest card um aquas shield oh this is pretty cool uh plus 200b if you uh if uh aquas Balkan, uh if aquas 
draw a card. So that's pretty cool. Um, Unraveled Jump plus 900. That's actually a lot of a lot of B power there. A lot of darkest ones in this one. Um, Plasmic Bolt. Ooh, get uh, plus 300 B and plus six damage. That's actually really cool. Alrighty, uh, Laser Claw. That's pretty good. Oh wow, 10 damage for six energies. Not terrible. Um, here is our rare, um, which we get plus shadow. Um, now this here, um, we don't know too much about this whole shadow thing, but we do know that's the name of it. It's called Shadow. Um, there's also a, um, uh, I think like a frost or frozen one. Don't know the name of it, but you can see like a, a like a ice symbol on it that you know that's what's going to be. And then it can sacrifice. You may discard a card f uh, for five extra damage. Wow, that's actually really cool. I think this is actually one of the ones I was going to put into my deck um, because it's actually a, a low cost. And then you get that sacrifice. You can discard a card, and that would work with China Riot, um, which would be really cool. And then, oh, almost thought it was China Riot there for a second. But no, this is a Rite of Darkness uh, for five energies. Choose a player to discard a card uh, for each Darkness Bahugan on your team. Wow, so you actually discard a card. Now we have a awesome rare E. Oh, wow. Okay, here we go. So it says, uh, when you open a Bahugan, plus three energy for the turn. What? So if you open a Bahugan, you basically are getting three extra energies for free. That's really cool. Um, and of course, it's a five-star cost. And you can kind of see it's hollow-ish. Um, let me see here. I'm going to pull it up here just to see. Um, it's not, what's really, it's not really the cards hollow, it's actually the lettering here. Um, you can see it got like that shine on it there, that little, that E. You can see the E and the five and the hero down there. Um, that is really cool. So yeah, that's, a, that's our awesomer and we have a Bahugan Elite Olifex card. Oh my gosh. This is a super hard one to find too. I mean, this is a Hex card and a Bahugan Elite. This is Titan Nilius. Oh my gosh, this is really cool. Look at that. It's an Evo card for Titan Nilius Darkus, which is actually one of the cards I'm going to be using my deck. So this card I will be definitely using. It has 300 B or 1300 B power. Um, and it's a does four damage and costs six energies, which isn't bad. And then it is Victor. When uh, you may discard a card for plus four damage. Uh, you may use this any number of times. So you can discard as many cards as you want and you get an extra 4 damage. So you want to make sure you win and you keep doing damage over and over and over again. Oh my gosh. That is cool. I got sleeves for these guys just for this. I got sleeves. Uh, actually, you know what? I don't even want to put this in a red sleeve. I got even a better sleeve for it because I'm going to be putting that in the deck. So I'm going to put that in one of my black sleeves. Oh, that is gorgeous. Oh, I love that. I'm going to put this one in the red sleeve, though, because, yeah. Oh, that is really nice card. Oh, that's really cool. I'm excited already. That was the first pack, too. So, we have 11 more packs to go. Man, I bet you can only get better from here. Maybe. I don't know. Um, so, we're going to get into the next pack here, because that is really cool. Oh, I'm so excited. That, that's really neat. That's cool to having a first pack be that. Oh. All right. So, here's our next pack. So, we have... Uh, counter Chaos. This is one of the flip cards that uh, you could do. Um, so, of course, you flip and the zero cost energy. So, basically, when you take damage, uh, this would be on top of your deck. Uh, whenever you flip the card, because you have to flip a card uh, face uh, face up uh, off the top of your deck and put in the discard. If it's one, if it's a flip card, you can use it. Uh, and then you can uh, pay that energy cost and use it. Of course, this is zero, so you don't have to pay anything, and it stops a uh, Chaos Bakugan from damage. So you take the no more damage after you play that card. So yeah, so that's, a, uh, that's our flip card. Then we have uh, Strength of Maxator, uh, which is actually kind of cool. Plus eight damage. That's actually really cool. Um, then we have Cycling Thoughts, um, which is the draw two cards to return this card to the bottom of the deck. Okay. Um, Ebb. Uh, which is kind of interesting. Plus two damage, and then you get the flow. If you played another card this turn, this is five damage instead. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, then we have Toxify, minus three damage for zero energy. Is that three damages to your opponent, or three damages to you? There's some, like, uh, wording issues on some of these, I've noticed, because um, there's, like, an, the Chaos type, uh, the Chaos, um, was I think, Hypernilius Chaos form? 
Um, that one has some wording issues uh, on it because it is weird. If we pull it, I'll show you what I'm talking about, um, but it, it's weird. Um, so, yeah, so I don't know if this is to you or to your opponent, but either way, that's actually kind of interesting. Um, then turn to energy. Uh, energize this card uncharged so that you pay two energy to play that. Interesting. Uh, then we have our rare, which is uh, sowing seeds. Uh, and you, for three energies, is a flip card, and you do a turbo. If you have the most energy cards in play, draw two cards. Interesting. Um, so that's a eh, that's kind of iffy because you don't want to draw cards after you do the da uh, trying to take damage because that'd be really that could be bad. Um, then we have our next rare is engulfing embers. Um, for five uh, five energies, you get plus four hundred and plus six damage. Interesting. And then we have a awesome rare, a uh, hyper maxator ultra. Wow, that's actually really cool for the uh, Arliss. Uh, faction. Of course, if you land on the um, DNA uh, cores, you get plus 300 B power and plus 3 damage. And he does uh, 700 B power uh, and then 5 damage. And he's an Evo card, uh, Evo card, of course. And then you have the uh, 2 energy cost for it. So, yes. And our next card is a hex card. It's a common hex, um, which is Razor Claws. For 3 energies, you get uh, plus 2 damage. Turbo, if you have the most energy cards in play, you do 7 damage instead. So there you go. So yeah, that's that hex. You can see that hex a little bit better than that one. I mean, you could see it in that one, but you kind of can see the uh, kind of the hex design that they went with, which is actually really nice. I like the way that looks. So we're going to stick that one in the back. Uh, we're going to open our next pack here. Um, let's go ahead and put the awesomer one in the uh, sleeve here. The hollow one, I'm going to put that in the sleeve too, because i got a bunch of sleeves sitting out here in the side. Uh, just sitting out might as well just put them all in there. So we're gonna put those there And we're gonna go to the next pack um, Actually, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put this card to the side a little bit because that one oof 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 That's a nice one. All right, let's get the next card get these packs out of the way because I don't need those right now and Let's go ahead and open the rest of this here so this is actually some really cool stuff here. I'm excited for all this um, and getting into all this. This is really cool. I hope you guys do enjoy it. Um, so yeah, so we have our first one, which is Aqua Shield. Um, then we have Light Courage, Light's Courage, um, which is really interesting. Um, then we have Wither, uh, minus three uh, damage, but one energy cost. So like I said, I don't know if that's for you or for your opponent. I'm not for sure. Um, then we have uh, our next common is Beaming Blaster. Um, interesting. Uh, blinding Glam. Yeah, Blinding Glam. Minus three energy to your enemy's Bahugan, or plus three uh, damage to one of your Bahugan. Interesting. I'm sorry, that might have been off screen for a little bit. I'm like looking at it over uh, over the camera and not through the camera, so yeah. Alright. Then we have the Ice Wall, plus 900 B power. That's interesting. Common for four energy. It's not too bad. And then our rare is Inferno for one energy. You get plus two damage for each Pyrus Bahugan on your team. Well, that's not too bad if you're running a Pyrus deck. If you're running like uh, two different, uh, three different Bahugan, may not be the greatest, but that's not bad though. Um, then we have our next rare is Gargonoid's Gl uh, Gaze. Uh, destroy a hero with a cost of four energies or less. Interesting. That's 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 an interesting one uh, for two energies. Then we have our. Ooh, what is this one? This is a Bakugan Elite. This is a normal Bakugan Elite. This is what they look like. Oh, man. The whole card itself is hollow. I don't know if you can tell it, but it's a dark hollow card. And this is uh, Aquas Maximus Hydrus Hydorus Ultra. What? Dude, look at that card, though. Oh, my word. That is crazy. All right, so... Of course, we got to go through it here. Um, the B power is 1,400. That's actually really high. Uh, then we That's even higher than Titanilius over here. Then we had does 6 damage. Of course, he's an evil card for 8 uh, energy cost. And you guys, Victor, uh, you may play an Aquas card for free. So you can play any Aquas card for free. Wow. So that means you can get the strongest Aquas card. T uh, put it up with him and you can play it for free that's crazy all right and our next card is oh we got a common uh cease darkness so for zero energies you can stop a darkness bahugan 
I like that kind of that, that uh, hollow look there. You can see a little bit uh, goes to the bottom down there. Uh, but that is a nice, I like that look. So let's go ahead, we need to put him in a sleeve here. I'm going to put him in the ba uh, black sleeves because like I said, the, the cool ones I'm putting in here because that's a really cool one. Oh, that's a nice card right there. We're going to put him up with there. Um, put this one in a red sleeve. I know, you may be like, why do you have so many sleeves, man? You see me? Well, you know what? I play Pokemon. you got to have sleeves. So, deal with it. I have them laying around. These are just extra ones I had laying around. So, might as well use them. Alright, so, here's our next one. Eh. And, eh. get that out of here. Yeet. Then, let's get on to our next one here. We have Turn 2 Energy. Um, we've had this card already. Um, then we have Shadow Hue. Uh, for two energies plus 100 uh, B power and plus three damage. That's interesting. Uh, then we have smoke armor. Uh, for three energy, you do five B power, 500 B power. Cycling thoughts. We've already seen this one before. Um, Ventus Moonbeam, uh, which does uh, minus four damage, uh, but you get turbo. If you have the most energies cards in play, you do minus eight damage. See, it's like this. I don't know if that's for your opponent or not um because i mean i don't think i would want to play that if that's against me if it's against my opponent i would play this totally if i'm playing a Ventus deck i would use it um then we have another common here ebb we've seen that one that's pretty cool then we have our rare which is titan dragonoid aquas wow okay i know there's a pyrus version which is really cool um of titan dragonoid there but six that's not bad um, six energy cost. Uh, does uh, he has one thousand two hundred uh, B power? Of course, he's an evil card. Um, and then you get uh, does six damage. No additional effects, which is fine. But he's not. This is pretty big. This is a pretty dra big old dragonoid there. That's actually pretty cool. Um, so yep. So that's our one of our rares. Our next one is Hyper Trox Pyrus. Um, for two energies, uh, you do six hundred B power, an evil card. And he does two damage, and he does Victor uh, plus two energies. So I'm guessing he gets to add two energies to your pile, which is uh, which would be cool. Um, of course, like I said, some of the rulings or some of this, it, it's not like fully explained. So what's like the whole everything is released and the cards released, everything like that. Everyone has their hands on it. They'll probably release some more rules or some clarification on some of these things. So yeah, so which would be really nice. Um, and then we have a super rare. Uh, Mind Flood, uh, which is actually cool, uh, for two damage, uh, you, or not two damage, but two energies, uh, you get plus two damage, uh, and plus two damage for every other card you play this turn. So this is actually really cool. I think this is actually one of the ones I was going to do in my deck, uh, because I am going to be using, uh, Darkest, Aquas, and Pyrus. Um, so this is actually really good, um, especially when you're losing a, using a, uh, low energy cost of cards. This is actually going to be really good. Um, so yeah, so and of course it's our super rare here and our next card is oh the way you tell of course is uh, Super rare there and usually the uh, uh, The name up top will be red and they'll have like that red energy red there. So it gives it that super rare look so yeah, and our next card is a Common ebb of course we got to get ebb. That's the way to go uh, And then of course plus two damage flow if you play another card this turn you do five So which is kind of like kind of like mind flood. So if you do mind flood in that that's four energies Dude, that's actually not bad. You're going to be doing um, five. Then uh, you get this um, plus another two and then two. That's four. So you're getting doing an extra nine damage if you play uh, use four energies for that. So that's actually not bad. So let's go ahead and get our sleeves for these here. Um, I'm going to put this one in a red sleeve. I know. I thought you weren't going to put it in all. Yeah, I know. But I'm doing it anyway. Deal with it. Um, we're going to put that one in here, put that there, and then our next pack here, um, let's go ahead and open that one up, get that paper out of the way. Some of these packs are kind of weird to open. I know, I think I should like cut these before, uh, before I open them. Um, maybe, maybe not. What do you guys think? Um, might be a little easier. I mean, it's not hard to open, but you know, hey, um, then we have impact lasers, our next card here, uh, for three energies, seven damage. Then we have Luminescent Armor for four uh, energies. You do n plus 900 to a Chaos Bahugan. That's not bad. Um, Pandox Punch. For five energies, you do uh, plus four damage and a draw card. This Bahugan hasn't been released yet, uh, but it should be coming out here soon in the next wave or two, um, which is actually a really cool Bahugan. Um, I've seen pictures of him. He's actually really neat looking. Um, so yeah, 
Then we have Cloak and Shadow. Um, for two energies, you do uh, plus three damage and shadow. So that's actually, that's interesting uh, for a common. So um, I, I don't know. It might be a decent card. Um, then we have Shine uh, for three energies plus five damage. That's not bad. And then we have another common here. We have Static Shock for two energies. Oh, I just hit that camera. That is like a big knock over on the camera. There we go. Perfect. Uh, Static Shock, we have Draw Like Card. Uh, Domination, of course, You uh, if you have the most uh, Bahu Cores hold, you get to draw two cards instead of one. All right, then we have a rare. We have Lightning, which is a little doggy. The little dog that we have in... Um, and uh, in the show, he's like one of the main characters. He's like the dog of the team. Uh, and you get, uh, he does two d energy for flip a card. Uh, costs you one less to play. So flip cards cost one less. So you can play this card. Uh, and those flip cards uh, that are one, well, guess what? Now they're less. So that's actually really cool. He's a, he might be a good card to use, actually. Um, and then we have Diamond Pegatrix. Oh, man, we have the Diamond Pegatrix here. This is actually really cool. Of course, we don't have the Bahugan to go with. I mean, we only have the um, Chaos version of them. Um, but the Diamond one, this is actually really cool. So if we wanted to use it, we can still use the card. We just don't have to have the Diamond Bahugan. Um, of course, 6 uh, energies. Uh, 1,200 B power. An Evo card. And he does 6 damage. That's actually pretty cool. So that's a neat one. And then our next card is an awesome rare. Diamond Max or Ultra. Oh, we got an oh, an, another diamond rare and an awesome rare. He's 10 energies. Whoo! That's a lot. That's a lot of energies. Uh, for, for that, my gosh. But you do get 1,500 B power. Wow. Man, that's a lot of B power. And then, of course, he's an evil card. So you have to have the Max or Ultra Inventus to play this card. I um, mean, he does 15 damage. Oh! Well, dang! No wonder why he's a 10 energy cost because of that. That's crazy. Okay, so this is actually a really cool one there. And then our next card is a common hex card. Think again. Uh, it does two energies. Uh, draw a card at flow if you do draw two instead. I think we just got that one. Did we just get that one? Oh, no, that was Static Shock. Same thing, but uh, for Aquas. Okay, so that's actually really cool. We got this, uh, the Diamond Maxor Ultra. That's cool. Um, let's go ahead and put him in the sleeve here. Put you there. And then put this one right there. So, yeah, so that's those. That's pretty cool, though. Let's go ahead and get to our next pack here. Uh, man, this is a long pack opening, I will have to say. Uh, of course, that's why we're splitting up into two sections, because... I want to talk about these cards because some of these cards are really cool um, to talk about. Let's go ahead and take that, throw that away. And then let's see here. Oh, we got Cease Chaos, um, which is really cool. So you get the uh, zero energy cost there for our flip card. I'm just going to put that one down. Then we have Wild Strike for four energies, minus four damage. Uh, energize this card um, as uncharged. Then we have uh, Cease of Darkness, um, or Curse of Darkness. I'm sorry, Curse of Darkness. Um, plus it is two energies minus two damage. Um, sacrifice if you may discard a card and you minus 10 damage instead. I don't know why you would want to do that if that's to you. That's stupid. Um, then we have um, circling madness uh, for three energies. You may draw a card and your opponent discards a card. Return this card to the bottom of the deck. Huh. So you get to draw a card if he discards a card. So that would be interesting. Um, then we have another flip card which is counter aggression. So if you're a Chaos or a Pyrus Bahugan, um, you will be stopped by this card. So that's actually pretty cool. Um, so let's go ahead and go to the next one here. Another comment, we have Dark uh, Boost for two energies plus five damage. That's pretty interesting, so that's not too bad. And then we have our Rare, which is Titan Halicore Ultra. Oh, this is cool. Um, we get the five dam or five energies. Uh, then he has 1300 B power. Evo card for the... Um, Halicore Ultra uh, Chaos Form. Uh, it does 5 damage. And then if you land on a DNA one, a uh, DNA card or core, you get plus 6 damage. That's actually really cool. Uh, so then we have our next rare is Diamond Fangzor. Man, we are getting diamonds like crazy. Oh my word. This is like the third diamond one we pulled. Um, and this is for the Fangzor uh, Pyrus version. Uh, you do have 6 energies. Um, and it is... 1200 B power, Evo card, of course, to the uh, Pyrus Fengzor. Uh, he does 6 damage, so that's actually not too bad. 
And then our next card is another one! We pulled two of the Bahu Gun Elites Maximus Ultra Hydrorus Ultra. What in the world? We pulled two of him! There's one there and there's one here! And this is the only box they had in the store and we pulled two of them? What? That's crazy! Oh my word! It's a Bahu Gun Elite too! That is ridiculous! Oh my gosh, that's crazy. And then our next one is um, a awesome rare, uh, Luck Aura. Uh, for four energies, it's a flip card, play uh, play a card from your hand for free. That's pretty cool, but dang. We pulled two Bahugan Elites that were the same ones. Now, that's a little upsetting because you pulled two of the same ones, you wish it was something different. Um, but... That is actually still pretty cool, though, that you pulled two. I mean, I pulled two of them, so I can have one. If I wanted to use two, well, guess what? I have two now, so... Dang! That's crazy. Oh, let me go on ahead and put him... Not in the red sleeve. You guys saw that? I put him in the red sleeve. I'm bad. I'm bad. Put down in the comments below how bad I am because I did that. There we go. So, wow. Okay. This is getting interesting. Um, And we still have, what, six packs to go? We still have six packs to go. My goodness, already six packs like that? That's absolutely crazy. Ugh, that was a little tough. All right, so let's go ahead and open the back here. And let's see if we can slide them out. All righty. Oh, man, this, I have to say, if you guys, if you, you need to get a hold of some of these guys, you need to get some, because you get some really good pulls with this. This is cool. All right, so next one, we have Light Break. Uh, for two energies, of course, you get the 300 plus, and if uh, you're a Hayas, you get the uh, 600 ascent. Song of Fire plus uh, five damage or five energy plus five energy plus five. Do you get like an extra five energy? What? Okay, that's confusing. Five energies and there's energies up here, and that's three energy. So you get an extra five. I don't, I, I don't get. The, I guess, I guess you can use an extra five that turn. So you play the, th pay the three, and then you get five uh, after that. That I guess it's not bad. If that's what it does, that's not bad. Um, Talon slash for three energies, you do four damage. Uh, if this Bahugan, uh, Bahugan's damage becomes ten or greater, draw a card. Interesting. Um, then we have Crushing Grasp. Uh, minus 1,000 B power. I sure hope that's not on you. Because if it is, well, dude, you're out of luck. Don't play that card. Um, Light's Courage. Um, then we've seen that one before. Lava Boost. I think we've seen that one before. If not, well, here it is. Uh, does six energies for nine, plus 900 uh, B power. Then we have our rare, uh, which is Diamond and Nilius. We have a Diamond Nilius. Oh, this is cool. I mean, I've already used Darkest Nilius, so and we've already got the Titan form in the back there. Wow. Okay, so we get the Darkest Diamond Nilius for seven energies. Uh, it does fifteen hundred B power. He's an evil card, of course, and he does eight damage. That's pretty cool. We got the diamond one. That's neat. So that means we can add that to our diamond collection. I'm just gonna put that one in the back there. And then we have a uh, Cole. Cole. Uh, why can't I? Make Commander, uh, whatever his name, Cole Armstrong uh, Trip, for three energies. Uh, he is a hero card, so when one of your Bahugan attacks, draw a card. This is pretty cool. Um, so you just draw a card whenever you attack. And then our next card is an awesome rare, Night Lightning. Uh, draw the card, and then sacrifice. You may discard a card uh, for plus three damage. You may use this any number of times. Wow. That's actually pretty cool. So you basically draw a card and discard it, and then you get an extra three damage. Or if you want to discard two cards, six damage. That's actually not bad. Uh, for four energies, that's actually pretty cool. Um, and then, oh, Hyper Dragonoid. We got a Hyper Dragonoid. Uh, what is this? Rare. Okay, so it's not, I mean, it's a rare, but even still, though, Hyper Dragonoid. Uh, this is really cool. This is actually one of the ones I was going to be putting in my deck uh, with the Dragonoid, because with those guys right here. Um, does what For one energy, that's actually not bad, but... He does get, uh, he does double his, like, B power, so it comes from 2 to 400. Uh, evolves off of the normal, uh, Pyrus Dragonoid. Um, then he does 6 damage, which is actually really nice. Um, then if you land on a Fire Fist, you do get plus 300 B power, and then plus 3 damage. So that's actually really cool, and it's actually a Hex card, too. So that's really cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that one in there. And we're gonna stick that in the back there. Um, then we're gonna put this one and that one. 
and stick that to the side there. Uh, I'm going to take the diamond one. I'm going to go ahead and put it in a sleeve just so I have it in a sleeve because I like that one. Um, I'll probably put all the other diamond ones in a sleeve as well uh, later on. But we're going to stick that one there. And then on to our next pack. My goodness, this pack opening. There is so many hollow cards. I mean, this is crazy. How many hollow cards we have. Uh, let's go ahead and get him out here. Let's see here. Come on. There we go. Nice thing is they don't get damaged a whole lot when you're opening the pack, so which is nice. Alrighty. So, we have Cycling Light. Um, have we seen this? I don't know if we've seen this one, but for 1 energy uh, plus 200 B power, then put this card on the bottom of your deck. Okay. Um, then we have a Stone Skin. Um, for Does it look damaged? It looks a little bent there, but it's not terrible. Um, for 3 energies, you do plus 200. Sacrifice, you may discard a card uh, for 800 B power instead. So that's not bad. Um, then we have um, Repel Ventus. For zero energies, of course, you stop a Ventus Bach gun. That's our flip card. Um, Tainted Touch. For two energies, uh, you can do two damage uh, for two extra damage. And then Sacrifice, if you discard a card, you can do seven instead. Well, that's not too bad there. Then we have our next flip card, which is Ventus Power. Uh, for four energies, you can stop a non-Ventus uh, Bahugan and draw the card. Interesting. Okay. Um, then we have uh, another one. Is Terrify. Well, this is actually like our first one that we pulled. The first card that we had. Um, then we have our rare, which is Bill Kuzo. Okay. Um, this is Dan Kuzo's uh, father. Uh, for two energies, uh, when your opponent plays a flip card, you may draw a card. So that's not that's not terrible. Uh, I mean, if your opponent, if you're doing a lot of damage, that's actually not bad. Um, so that's actually pretty cool. So we got uh, Bill Kuzo. And then our next rare is, oh my gosh, Barbara Kuzo. We got the mom and the dad. Can we get, can we get the, uh, can we get Dan Kuzo in this box? If we can get Dan Kuzo in this box, we got the whole family. And you know what? I will play the whole family in my deck just for that reason. Just so you guys know, I will do it. Okay. If we can pull the Dan Kuzo, which is actually one of the really best cards in this deck, or not in this deck, but in this uh, set, with the Titan Dragonoid, if you can, if I could pull the Dan Kuzo, I don't care if it, it's a Bahugan Elite, so which is going to be hard. But if I could pull that uh, in either a Hex form or just even in Bahugan Elite form, I will play Barbara Kuzo and Bill Kuzo. Okay, all right. So let me go ahead and let's see what the um, what the Barbara Kuzo does. Uh, for three energies, you get Fury. At the end of the turn, you may, if you have no cards in your hand, you may draw a card. <laughs> That's not too bad. So this actually isn't bad. Um, in the way I like to play things, uh, what I'm going to do is in my deck, I'm going to be discarding a lot. And then, of course, the Pyrus cards have that theory thing. So you have no cards, you get an extra boost. So this is actually going to be really cool. So at the end of the turn, no cards in hand, boom, get to draw a card. Everything else gets played off. Next turn, I can have two cards in my hand from that draw. So that's actually really cool. Um, our Oh, Hyper Nilius is our secret or super rare. I'm sorry, super rare. Oh, that's really cool. Um, Hypernilius, uh, in Chaos form. For two energies, you get, uh, 500 B power. Um, then you get the, uh, Evo card, of course. Uh, then plus six damage. If you land on the, uh, blue shield, you get plus 200 B power. Fire Fist, you plus two damage. That's actually really cool. And our next card is a secret, or super rare, uh, hex card. I don't know why I say secret, because I'm thinking secret SR. Um, Gravity Shift, uh, for five, uh, energies. Uh, choose a Bahugan. Your opponent chooses uh, if it gets a uh, thousand B power, or it's plus ten damage. That's actually pretty cool. I mean, it's a lot of energy costs, but that's actually not bad. Um, so that's actually will be good for you. Um, they'll probably choose that B power, uh, or it, it'll be really tough to see which one they choose. Uh, so yeah, so that'd be really cool. So let's go ahead and get those sleeved up here. Um, I, I'm gonna probably, um, you know what? I'm gonna do this too because just because why not? We are going to sleeve up. Uh, Barbara Cuzo and Bill Cuzo because I just want to do it because this is actually kind of funny same pack too and you guys saw that if we had all three in the same pack I I don't know what to say that would be really cool so there's those we have four more packs to go um, let's get the next one here we're trying to go through them a little quicker here because I mean my thing says 35 even though it's been sped up a little bit uh, there we go get the trash out of the way um Lava Boost, Magma Boost, we got Lava Boost and Magma Boost, we got them both, and they do a lot too, a lot of B-Power Boost. Um, then we have Repel Darkest, 
For zero energies, of course, you can stop a darkness, uh, the da darkest damage that you take. Um, then we have Block Aquas, um, which is the same thing, but against Aquas, Bakugan, and it's a Pyrus card, so that's really cool. For zero energies, too. Um, Meltdown, uh, destroy an energy card, so you have to destroy an energy card. Um, then uh, Metronoic Lance, Metronoic Lance, whatever it is, however you say it, I said it probably wrong. Um, for five energies, you do get plus 11 damage. Wow, that's actually really cool. For a rare, we have uh, Wayne. I think that's how you say it. Wayne? Yeah. For two energies, destroy an Evo that has not played this turn. Okay, okay, I know what it means. Okay, so by played, it means that if it hasn't popped open this turn. So if it already has an Evo card on it, um, like if I put Hyper Nilius on my Nilius, um, then I can destroy the uh, Hyper version, his Evo version. He'll go back to his normal version. That's what that does. Okay, um, our next rare is... In Venom, in Venom, okay, for uh, three energies, you do uh, minus five B power, or not five B power, but five damage, uh, turbo, if you have the most energy cards uh, in play, you can draw a card, and then our next card is an awesome rare, shun, we got a shun card, ooh, so this is the, um, the, what is, I'm trying to think here, this is the uh, Aquas main brawler in the show, uh, for two energies, um, Evos cost one less to play. That's interesting for an awesome rare. And our next card is, I see it's Pyrus. Oh, can it be? Can it be? <gasps> Hyper, um, what is it? Separate, Separatist? Ultra. Wow, that's actually a very shiny card. You guys may not be able to see it, but when I pulled it out, this whole entire text was absolutely shining. It was just like blinding me with rainbow lights. That's actually really cool here. I've seen this Bakugan out, um... On shelves, I just haven't picked it up yet, uh, but this is actually really cool. Um, it does for two energies, you get 500 B power. Evo card, of course, on the Pyrus version of the that there, not the hyper. Just take the hyper out, and that's the one you need. Uh, does seven damage. Fury, if you have no cards in your hand, uh, plus five damage and plus one thousand B power. That's really cool. That's really strong too. So that's actually really cool stuff. So we got, and that is a awesome rare too. That's cool. So let's go ahead and sleeve those guys up. Um, the Shun is actually really neat. Um, of course, in the original anime, he was a Ventus Brawler. Now he's a uh, a Aquas Brawler, which is actually interesting. Oh, oh drop my sleeve a little bit. There we go. And three more packs. My goodness, this is taking forever. Wow. Um, it's a long pack opening, I will have to say. I sure hope you guys stay through. So if you didn't, well, then guess what? You skip to the end. That's perfectly fine. Then you guys, I'll, I'll do the recap later. So yeah. So, here we go to our next one. We have Super Shot for 1 energy. And we have Dream Illusion uh, for 5 energies. You do plus 1,100 damage. That's really good. Um, Wave Slash. Aqua Shield. I'm kind of going through them a little fast now. Um, fraggle. Uh, fra fragile Light to Light. I don't know. Fragile to Light. There you go. Fragile to Light. Eh, I couldn't speak there for a second. That's a common. Another common is Heroic Strength. A rare is Titan Halicore Ultra. Did we just pull this one earlier? I think we did. I think we've already pulled that one. So that's actually I need to get another one. Then we have uh, Victoria Vintages. I think this is... Oh, this is. So this is um, the... Uh, I forgot her name now. Why can't I think of her name? The the girl main character uh, in the show. This is her mom. Um, now, she does have different hair in the TV show than she does uh, here. Um, there was a reason for that, uh, I guess they, they printed the cards before they did this TV show, um, so yeah, that was a thing, um, or the TV show was made before the cards was, and this was just a concept, or I don't know, there was something like that, so she had blue hair in the, uh, or I think it's blue hair, I think she has light blue hair, she has some different color hair than brown, so yeah, so, um, of course, three energies, domination, uh, if your Bahu gun are holding the most, uh, Bahu cores, Plus three damage to your attacks. That's our one of our rares. And our next one is a uh, super rare C. For two energies, you get plus shadow uh, to your darkest Bach gun. If you deal 10 or more damage in an attack, you may draw three cards. Interesting. For two energies, that's that's interesting. Um, of course, with this whole shadow uh, effect, I'm curious what that does um, with the shadow thing. So that would be, that would be interesting to see what that does. Then our next card is a rare... Um, Corporing Mist, uh, Corrupting Mist, I'm sorry, Corrupting Mist, for 4 energies, uh, you get to do 100 B Power Plus, uh, for each 1 damage your Bahugan has. 
So you basically get another B power for each damage that you do. That's interesting. Interesting concept uh, for that. That's 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 different. All right. I'm going ahead and put that one in the sleeve. Go ahead and put that one in the sleeve. Stick that one in the back there. Uh, we got some good amount of hero cards too, uh, which is really nice. And we're going to head open up to our second to last pack here of the part one of our unboxing here. Um, and here we go. We're going to get into Wither. Then we have Beaming Blaster, uh, Blinding gl uh, Glam, Song of Fire, uh, Talon Slash, uh, Bone Defense plus 700 B Power. That's pretty good. And our rare is Hot Potato. Hot Potato is pretty funny. It's actually, if you want to read it there, remove uh, an enemy's Bahu Guns, Bahu Core, and negate the effect. You can return the Bahu Core onto the field face down. That's interesting for two energies, too. Um, then we have Hyper Nilius, another Nilius card for the Arliss typing, too. Um, you get uh, 800 B power, an evil card, uh, and then it does 8 damage. If you discard this card, you may play it for free. Oh, so this is like one of those discarding things. So that's actually really nice. So if you're doing the Arliss Darkest deck, that's actually really cool. So that would work with the normal Nilius as well, the Darkest one. Um, and then you do the 3 energy cost as normal. Then we have a super rare Titan Pegatrix. Wow, Titan Pegatrix. We got a lot of Titans in this one, on this these 12 packs. Uh, it does four energies. Uh, B power is 1,000. Evo card, of course, to the uh, Chaos Pegatrix. Uh, then it does four damage. Uh, and then, f what is it? The uh, If you land on a green fist, plus 500 B power and plus five damage. So that's actually really cool for a super rare. And we have another rare hex, and it is Shuruken. Uh, this is really cool. So it's like the uh, Street Fighter name, Shuruken. Um, you get plus uh, one damage. Return this card to your hand for two energies. Um, uh, I don't know about that. I mean, it's, it's a, for two energies for that. I don't know. That might be, that might be a little tough one there. Let's go ahead and put the sleeves on that one there. And, ooh, oh man, it's down to the last pack. Are we able to get Dan Kuzo in this set here? If we can get Dan Kuzo in this pack right here, oh my word, this is going to be crazy. We will definitely be able to do something really cool here. So. Let's go ahead and open them up here. Oh, I just threw it. The whole pack just literally fell out and went there. Thank goodness it went face down because I sure didn't want to see that back card there. I want that one to be a surprise. So let's go ahead and grab this here and let's see. So we have a um, um, Exhalerate. Excel yeah, that card right there. I can't speak for some other reason. I'm still, I'm so shocked with all the stuff that we got. Um, draw a card. Um, then we have Cease Outsiders. So if you're not a non-Darkest Bakugan, um, you get stopped. Then we have our next card is Shadow Hue. Um, there we go there. Then we have Venom Blast. Smoke Armor. Next coming is Cycling Thoughts. For our rare, we have Heroic in, uh, Impression? Heroic Impression. Uh, draw a card for each, uh, hero you have in play. Okay, so for two energies for a flip card, that's not too bad. Our next rare is... Diamond Nilius again! We got two Diamond Niliuses. Wow, that's actually really cool. Um, and then our next card is an awesome rare Titan Halicore Ultra. Oh man, that's cool. Um, because what we did we get the um there's a Chaos version somewhere. Did I have the Chaos version somewhere? I may have it or something. There's something we had for um Halicore. I think it was I think it was Chaos, yeah. Um, and it does for five energies, you do 1,000 B power. An evil card, of course, to the darkest Halicor. Does one damage. Oof, that's a little lower. But this has uh, plus one damage for each flip card in your discard pile. So it does gain that damage there. And then our last card is... Oh, it's Aqua, so it's not going to be a Dan Kuzo, But it is a rare. So let's see. It is Whirlpool, uh, which is does three energies. Uh, for uh, three dam, you get plus three damage and flow. If you played another card this turn, you get plus three frost or frozen, whatever that thing is. You see that right there? I don't know if that's a ninja star or ice. It looks like an ice, uh, like snow symbol. Um, so I'm curious what that means. Um, and we're still waiting on that, like that in the shadow card, uh, shadow ability. I don't know what those do, but yeah. So that's it. So let's go ahead and put these in sleeves here. Um, we're going to go ahead and put that in the back. Put this here. And this sleeve and let's go on ahead and do our recap here um we could get them all recapped here uh, if i can get a grab them all there we go okay so we have a lot to recap so we have of course whirlpool these are all of our hexen shuriken um corrupting mist 
hyper uh, thing, ultra, yeah, gravity shift, hyper dragonoid, which is actually one of my favorite ones so far, I think, uh, out of the hex ones I liked, um, uh, luck aura, uh, think again, ebb, uh, cease darkest, um, razor claws, titan halicore ultra, we're starting to get into those awesome rares in the super, uh, super rares now, um, titan pegatrix, C, uh, shun, we have Hyper Nilius in the uh, Chaos, uh, Night Lightning, um, Ventus Diamond Maxator Ultra, that's a lot to say, Mind Flood, Hyper Maxator Ultra, and the Arliss, E, and then we got into our Bahugan Elites, which is Maximus, Hydrus, Ultra, Aquas, we got two of those, and then our Bahugan Elite Hex, Titan Nilius Darkus. Now, I hope you cousins did enjoy. If you did, make sure you click that like button down below uh, and show your support to that. And if you're new, make sure you click that subscribe button and become a cousin in our family. And remember, Ohana means family, and family means no one gets left behind or forgotten. And I will see y'all next time. Bye!